Carlos is the world record holder in this event as well. Ihar Boki, just a sensational swimmer. While he missed out on the gold medal in the 53, <laughs> in the five other events he competed in, he picked up gold. He completely dominated the S13 class in London, the Dihar Boki. The Brazilian Tomás Matera, sub-60 seconds this year. And Raman Salai, younger brother of Dimitri, goes in five. Quick start for uh, Boki in four and Sale in five. Cheers for Matera, the Brazilian swimmer, but straight into his stroke. And Ihar Boki showing his class already. He's well ahead in the opening 25 meters. And Ihar Boki should be looking to uh, bring this to the wall in relatively quick time here. Let's see what time he posts. 25.78 for Ihar Boki, who's got a very strong back end. Just how much energy does he want to expend in the morning heat? That'll be the question. Well, look at this. He is now storming ahead of the rest of the field. The crowd are going wild for Thomas Matera in lane three of Brazil, who's just in third at the moment, the race between second and third, because Ia Boki of Belarus has got this wrapped up. Let's see what time he can post this it, morning. It's, it's going to be quick. It's going to be, oh, just outside his world record. A 54-54 is a new Paralympic record, but what a race from Ihar Boki. And the crowd going wild for a strong finish there by Thomas Matera to come home. It's an equal, it's a tie for second between Thomas Matera and Raman Saleh of Azerbaijan, 58.40. Well, very strong swims from Matera and Saleh, indeed being dragged along, no doubt by the thoroughly impressive Borki. Saleh is a 57-second swimmer over this distance, but there's only one man to look out for gold, and that's Ihar Borki. He completely dominates in the S13 class, especially over two lengths of the olympic size pool, where he's just got an amazing abundance of energy in reserve. Well, there's the evidence of that domination, a four-second 